The MPL performs the tasks of many rapid prototyping machines in one machine. Most prototyping machines are only capable of one process, such as 3D ABS printing. The MPL is capable of an unlimited number of processes such as 3D printing, drop-on-demand printing, including nanoscale, laser curing, extrusion deposition, and many more. The MPL is the only machine on the market with this capability. The MPL is capable of producing fully functional, complex prototype parts without operation intervention. In fact, the MPL is also capable of low-rate part production. With the MPL, you do not need to move the prototype part from one machine to another. This provides many benefits including lower upfront cost, faster prototyping, amazing precision, lower prototype production costs, plus much more. The MPL is a multi-module machine. Each module or attachment performs a unique process such as 3D printing, drop-on-demand printing, laser curing, and many others. The MPL picks up a module such as the 3D dual additive printing head from its parked position and performs that process on the prototype part. Once that process is completed, it returns the module to its parked position. The MPL then picks up another module, such as an extrusion deposition module, and performs that process on the same prototype piece. This process can be repeated with an unlimited number of different modules until a completely functioning part is produced. The number of modules and their individual processes are limited only by the imagination and need of the user. The MPL is capable of an unlimited number of prototyping processes including 3D dual additive printing, drop-on-demand printing, extrusion deposition, copper printing, laser curing, pick in place, precision milling, plus many more. The MPL also has many in-process inspection capabilities including conductance testing, 3D measurement, and full color imaging. By incorporating a six-axis robotic arm in the base of the MPL, the prototype piece can be held at any angle, vastly increasing the capabilities of the machine. Now, for example, you are able to print in 3D, rotate the part, and lay down conductive metal on the side of the part. The MPL is also completely capable of producing in-service parts on a low scale. Need to make a part that is no longer produced? No problem. Need to make a few parts to test in service? The MPL can rise to the occasion. Imagine you had a remote field operations office. Imagine if it was difficult to transport parts to that office. What if you could produce the part at your main office, test it, and then email the code to your remote office MPL to produce the part in the field? Then there is no longer a need to transport a part to the remote location. Simply make the part right there. The MPL costs less than purchasing several prototyping machines to perform the same processes that the MPL can perform alone. The MPL saves money by performing multiple processes in one machine. Using the MPL requires you to only set up the prototype piece one time. Imagine not having to move the prototype piece from one machine to another. Imagine the time savings. Using normal prototyping methods, a prototype piece often has to be set up in multiple prototyping machines. Each time the prototype piece is set up in a new machine, the accuracy of the part is greatly reduced. With the MPL, all the prototyping steps are done on one machine. No moving of the part and no relying on the operator's skill to precisely reposition the part. Just straightforward 1,000th accuracy. 
One machine completes the prototype, so you do not need an operator to move the piece from one machine to another. Yes, moving a part from one machine to another during the prototyping process results in a loss of accuracy. But accuracy is not the only thing that you lose. The time and therefore the cost involved in an operator moving a part to different machines can really add up. Currently, there are two types of platforms available, the MPL-1000 and the MPL-2000. The main differences between the models are the maximum prototype size the machines are capable of producing and the number of modules that the platforms can hold. The compact MPL-1000 is capable of producing a part with dimensions of 20 inches by 24 inches by 6 inches. Up to two modules can reside on the machine at any time. The larger MPL-2000 is capable of producing a part up to 24 inches by 36 inches by 8 inches. Up to six modules can reside on the machine at any time. For either machine, you can increase the capabilities of the machine by manually changing out modules during the prototyping process. The MPL is more than a rapid prototyping machine. Yes, it is many prototyping machines in one. It can perform many prototyping processes all in one machine without moving the part. The MPL can also perform low-scale part production. The possibilities are unlimited.